And the question really is, why should I represent the Lord Jesus Christ? Because I believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. I believe that I'm a representative of Christ. As a representative of Christ, I must be uh, an expressor of love, if I may use that expression. I must convey love. I think that is the most important thing for a Christ follower. He must express love and acceptance. I must accept people from all backgrounds. Not just religious backgrounds, but also cultural backgrounds. It is important for a Christian to show love, to embrace others, especially those who are different from him. I think that is the best way in which Christianity can be shared. At least that's the best way in which Christ can be shared. And I do not believe in forcing anyone to believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. There should be no compulsion to believe. At least there should be no humanly induced compulsion. I think the best way Jesus can be conveyed is by expressing love. What kind of love is the question? It's not a love that grabs. It's not a love that, um, that retains. It's not a love that wants, but it's a love that is willing to give and always willing to give. St. Paul said it is more blessed to give than to receive. He said that Jesus said it. And yes, that's what Jesus is about. He's about giving. And the man of Christ must also be about giving. And that is what uh, I have done in my life and that is what I will continue to do. I do not believe in forcing people to accept certain doctrines. Such persuasion can be done only by God and in His divine way. It cannot be done in any human way. This I am certain of. And as a missionary for Jesus Christ, I don't go out and give Bibles to people and I don't see anything wrong with that. But I think the best way to convey Christ is to love people, is to love people in a selfless way, is to give to people what they need. And people need uh, encouragement, people need a sense of um, understanding. People need empathy and people need some guidance and all these can be provided without forcing doctrines on people. So the best way I believe is, is to, the best way to convey Christ to others is to show his love to them. He himself said before his death, love one another. And this is how people will recognize you. This is how people will know that you belong to me, by seeing your love, by feeling your love, by experiencing your love. And that is what I do in my life and that is what I will continue to do. And if you are a person who is interested in sharing Christ with someone who does not know Christ, who is from a different religious background or a different cultural background, I say to you, convey your love of Christ, accept them as they are, whoever they are, whether they are Muslims or Hindus or Sikhs, whatever their religion and whatever their cultural background, whether they are gays or straights, whatever sort of people they are, accept them as one of you, accept them as someone who belongs to your community, your community of Christ believers. Let us be a community of Christ believers who accept everyone, 
who accept people just as they are because that is how God accepts each and every one of us and that is how he accepted me and I am not a model Christian I'm not I'm not even like Christ I'm nowhere near that place where Christ is but I still qualify I'm still a child of God I'm still someone in Christ and that is really important if God can embrace me God should be able to embrace any other person and God does not say you've got to be something before I can accept you he accepts us just as we are and that is how we Christians we Christ followers must accept others especially those from different backgrounds shall we do that today